What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. So you've decided to buy a home, you've talked to your real estate agent and bam, they've told you you need a pre-approval letter first. What is a pre-approval letter? Why do you even need one? And how can you go about getting one? Well, I like to look at a pre-approval letter as a license to shop, right? You're about to embark on a journey that involves professionals, right? And it's a serious process if you think about it. So you're gonna to talk to your real estate agent, you're gonna go look in people's homes or listings if you would, and, uh, and gonna get involved in contractual information or, or business, right? And so it's a serious process. And so when I say kind of like a license to shop, I mean, it truly is kind of like your permission slip, if you would, to go and get involved and, and actually consult with all of these different professionals and properties. Okay, so what is involved? What does it consist of? Well, a pre-approval letter is basically um, a verification, all right, uh, of what you've put on your application and that it matches up with a particular loan program, all right? It basically is an indication to everyone involved that says, hey, this person can buy a home and uh, if it's, everything goes successful, will buy a home, all right? And so what it entails is looking at your qualifications based on your application. So we're gonna look at your income, we're gonna look at your assets, we're gonna look at your credit, we're gonna look at all those different things and basically take those things and merge them with a particular loan program based on the guidelines. So a pre-approval is not, hey, where do you work? Hey, how much do you, you, do you make it work? Hey, how much do you have? Oh, great, thanks for telling me, here's your pre-approval letter. No, it is, hey, you work here? We're gonna verify you work here. Hey, you tell me you have this much? Show me the bank statements or, or documentation to support that. Hey, um, you've got, uh, you, you know, you've got uh, X amount of score. You say you have a credit score of so much. We're gonna verify that. We're gonna pull it, right? And then taking that information that we've now verified and going in and running it through the particular loan program and getting an approval back from that investor, okay? That is what a pre-approval pre pre is, all right? It is not a simple pre-qualification. It is a approval that basically says, hey, listen, if you go about this process, you are going to close on your loan based on everything that you've put in your application. Now, even then, sometimes people lie, right? And they don't put accurate information, and we can't help you in that case, right? It's not a guarantee by any means. It's a pre-approval, right? Only an underwriter can give a final approval, okay? So garbage in, garbage out. It's not gonna just turn your application or your information or whatever you say into magical approval. No, it takes verification, it takes accuracy, and then pairing you with the right loan program and guidelines to get you to the finish line, all right? You need one because People don't want to spend time, all right? As much as your realtor would love to work with you, they don't want to spend time working with you and you're not actually able to get to that finish line. Sellers don't want people in their home that can't actually get to the finish line. I mean, it might hurt your feelings a little bit, but that's just the way it is. And if you're respectful of everyone's time and resources and energy, you'll make sure that your pre-approval is well uh, structured and it can get you to that. Uh, again, to that finish line, okay? And so um, how do we go about uh, uh, getting you a pre-approval? Well, again, you go through the process of, of, of submitting the information, we go through the process of verifying the information, and then we give you an actual letter once we've paired you with the right loan type. Now that letter is important, all right? So then ask yourself, what lender is on my pre-approval, right? Is, is your pre-approval uh, issued or was your pre-approval issued by a reputable lender, right? Because let me tell you, good listing agents and, and experienced sellers or well-informed sellers are looking at that. They want to make sure that you're not, you're not pre-approved by a lender that just asked you a bunch of questions and spit something out at you in a few minutes, okay? So you want to make sure that you're with a reputable lender, all right? And that process of making sure that that pre-approval is solid can take some time, especially when we get into more unique situations or more 
um, difficult loan types, right? We want to make sure that the information is accurate and that can take some time. So you may have to be patient with your lender, right? If they're doing their, their job correctly, you, you probably won't get a pre-approval in just minutes, right? Now, if you need it in a rush, just let us know and we'll spit out, you know, we'll spit out a pre-approval as quickly as we can once we have everything verified and we're confident that we can, we can get you to the closing table. All right, but sometimes, especially self-employed borrowers or more unique loan programs, it may take a day or two or three to get you that pre-approval. But regardless, you know, we'll get you there. And, and that is important. I'd much rather get a pre-approval from someone that I know will get the loan done than someone that's just trying to churn and burn through applications, okay? So that's huge. So once you have your pre-approval, now it's time to go and shop, all right? This is the exciting thing. And now you can do so in confidence knowing that, you know what? Yeah, that amount that I'm pre-approved for, that down payment that I said I can do, I know we're good to go. I know I can get to the close the table on this loan. And so, and your seller feels excited too because you've done your part, all right? So guys, if you're interested in getting a pre-approval, feel free to reach out for a one-on-one -on -one consultation via my calendar link in the description below. If you like the information that we've given you here today, go ahead and smash that subscribe button so we can keep, keep you informed what's going on. Uh, got a host of information coming each and every week, and so be sure to stay tuned to what's coming up. Thanks so much for your time, and I'll talk to you on the next video.